Today what I want to do is take you down to the Bayfront Park. It's one of my favorite places. Come and join me now. Here's a map of downtown Sarasota. The Bayfront Park is right here. Because I'm coming in from the south, I'm going to be driving up Bayfront Drive. I'm going to make a left right into the parking lot. There's plenty of parking right here. Let's head over. As you probably noticed from seeing the map, the Bayfront Park is located right on Sarasota Bay. This area is filled with boats and yachts. Locals to downtown take advantage of this park as there's plenty to do and there is truly something for everyone. There are many park benches to relax and take in the view and the views are spectacular. You can see sailboats gliding by, the Ringling Bridge in the far distance, of course Sarasota Bay and the dock yachts. And if you're lucky, you may even see a group of dolphins swim by. Want your own private space? Hang a hammock up and enjoy. Now for those with kids, the park offers a safe playground for children to have fun in. And if you're feeling active, this is the perfect place to come to for a jog and kayaking. The park can easily be walked on the promenade that goes all around it. You can also walk through the lawn. The park is home to many creative sculptures and pieces of art. For one, the Olympic wannabes was created by international renowned sculptor Glenner Goodacker and is now installed in the park. The Amphalos, a double spiral steel sculpture, was created by Richard Beckman and to me it's great to use as a frame within a frame, in other words, to frame a specific view. One of my favorites to see in the evening especially is the Fountain of the Dolphins. The fountain has four bronze dolphin figures. It was donated by the Staten Island Borough President's Office and sculpted by Stephen Dickey. Now, to end your visit, check out O'Leary's Tiki Bar and Grill for food and drinks. I hope you enjoyed this video. To see more like it, subscribe.